So David, do you just look at yourself in the mirror all day? <laughs> no. So you don't think? It scares me when I look in the mirror, so I try not to do it. Why? You're not vain? No, I don't think I am vain actually. People, people actually think I like, you know, that I, I don't actually like the way I look that much. I think I have a big nose and big ears and funny hair, and so yeah, I'd rather not look in the mirror. What position do you sleep in usually? Depends who's in the bed with me. Really? <laughs> What's your favorite sex position? What's your favorite sex position? Oh my god, I can't, I can't answer that. Why? I just can't. <laughs> so we'll just, we'll just assume. We'll just assume the dirtiest position. I would assume doggy style. Everyone loves doggy style, let's, let's, let's be honest. Right? Were you born this way? Born what way? This way. No, I was a lot smaller. <laughs> okay, perfect. Are you a feminist? Yeah, I'm really pro-feminist, actually. Wow. Really? That's great. Tell me, like... My march. For, like, the vote and stuff. I, I can't wait till you know, women get the vote. I think it'll be really, really good. So they get the vote? <laughs> A few bras and stuff as well. No, but all jokes aside, do you feel like women are better leaders than men, or at least on par with them? The, the thing I love about what, what they say about women is like they go, there'll be less wars if women were in charge. And then Margaret Thatcher took over, you know, as as, as prime uh, prime minister in UK, and she went to war in the Falklands. So then no one could say that anymore. So it was brilliant. My next question was going to be like, how many girls have you had this week? <gasps> mum because I had a girlfriend and she's not with me so oh yeah I did some research stalking and uh, I realized like yeah and uh, she's in a band right she's in a band yes does she sing to you in bed Oops. no can you sing for me something it's just, it's just for her that's how private it is what do you usually sing though oh I'm old school I'm like a crooner like proper Frank Sinatra Tony Bennett star I can see by her hair And my nose. Yeah, but you were born this way, so. <laughs> so what's your good side? I don't know, baby. I think it's, I have a scar on this side. So maybe it's that side. Your scar's hot. How'd you get it? I, someone actually shut the car door on my face. Why, did you piss them off? Probably, I pissed most people off. Why, what do you do? No, I didn't, it was my best friend, actually. Did you steal his girlfriend? No. Why not? Because we both didn't have girlfriends at the time. We were in New York getting over our last girlfriends. Hence the drunken closing car doors on ourselves. Why don't you ever do something crazy on the catwalk? Like, why don't you, like, I don't know, roll around on the floor, or, like, push somebody? Because, like, you're famous enough where, like, it'd be fine. And you'd probably get some great interviews. I, I think they'll frown upon that if I started rolling around. Because you'd wrinkle the clothes? A little bit tired halfway and just go. You know what, just, and just sit down. Or just sit down, just chuck someone off a seat and sit down myself. You should do it. I, I, apparently I can, with your permission. You have my permission. I tell the boys that, as I ruin their, their closure. Yeah, they would love it. I'm sure they would. <laughs> your place or mine? Where do you live? 24 March. In Milan? Yeah. Well, no, you have to come to London, so you have to be mine. I'm coming next week. Be careful what you say. <laughs>